Hey everybody, this is Kim. Another how-to video on uh, using the uh, BMW Motorrad Connected app. Recently, I, I saw a, a comment on one of the uh, posts of a Facebook group that asked, how can you import a GPX file into the Motorrad um, app uh, so you can use a pre-planned route? And um, I found a fairly simple solution. I'm going to go ahead and show it to you guys and um, let you... Um, see how easy it is to do this now i'm going to use the phone for this this is all strictly done on the phone you don't have to go to a, a laptop or a desktop pc to do this at all you should be able to also do this um, on a uh, tablet if you have an android tablet well i'm saying android tablet it could be an apple tablet as well but i don't have apple products so my review is strictly based on using an android uh, device so what i'm going to do first is i want to go to facebook because the actual um, GPX file was on a Facebook uh, page. Here's the Facebook page right here. And uh, you'll see that down here, this gentleman has got uh, several uh, GPX files um, on his Facebook app and uh, on his Facebook post. And if you want to download the um, GPX file, you just select which one you want, whether it's a couple's route, regular, scenic, or spirited. I want to go ahead and select the scenic route. So I'm going to select that. Downloaded the file. The file has been downloaded. I'm going to open it. Now it's in my downloads folder. You can see right here it says 2023 TTD Scenic Routes zip folder. Now the problem is I can't extract it from this particular page that I'm on. If I try to, it'll tell me can't open file. So what am I going to have to do? I have to go back to my main page. I have to go to my files um, folder which is why I have it on my uh, front uh, of my home screen I'm going to go to the downloads which is the little down arrow right here and there's the scenic routes zip now in order to extract this what I have to do is I have to select it like that and then under more I'm going to have extract to current folder I'm going to hit extract to current folder and it extracted the route so here's my scenic scenic route and I also downloaded earlier some spirited routes. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to find my scenic route GPX. So I've got scenic the Cherahala, scenic the Nantahala, okay, and scenic Smoky Mountain. So now, which one of these do I want to import into my Motorrad app? Well, let's try the scenic Cherahala. I've actually written that. Now here's the deal. If the Motorrad app is the only app that you have on your phone that can read a .gpx file, then all you have to do is select it and it actually automatically opens up the Motorrad folder and imports the GPX file right into your app. That's all you have to do. There's no moving things around. There's no going into the app and selecting import. You could do that, but because I only have one app that'll open up a GPX file, it automatically selected the right app and opened up inside of it for me. So now Scenic Charahala, I just select it. There's the route right there. I'm ready to go. Now that we have the route installed on the device, you, we bring up the map and you can see that it's asking us for a fastest route, or of course we can set other types of route um, suggestions. Um, but now it wants to know, do we want to go to the start point um, or a direct path? In other words, I'm not where the start of this route actually begins. I'm at home in another state, but I could either just have it start from the start point or I could have it um, from the start point. So in my case, I want to go to the start point because I have to get there from here to there. I would hit go to start point. Then it basically figures out where it's at. It calculates the route. The route begins. I hit go. And now if I was connected to the motorcycle, it would go ahead and start directing me uh, to uh, the route that I'm going to go to. But in this particular case, I just want to show you the easy way it was to install the uh, or import the route uh, from a Facebook page, downloaded it to my phone and imported it right into the app that easily. So if you have any questions, please feel free to look me up. Uh, please press like if you like this video and subscribe to my channel. Take care. Thanks for watching.